Eagles. I'm Jess Ward. And I'm Colton Jewell. And you're watching Eagle Eye News. Please rise for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Two of our main kids return on Valentine's Day. The dance will be on Saturday, February 14th, and the theme is Masquerade. If you want to bring an outside guest of Lakes, you must fill the dance guest application before purchasing tickets. Spirit Week is next week. Monday is Grout Fit Day. Wear all gray. Tuesday is Trendy Tuesday, so dress up in your favorite classy outfit. Wednesday is Workout Wednesday, and Thursday is Throwback Thursday, so dress in clothes from your favorite time period. Lastly, Friday is Flannel Friday. Indoor ice skating movie night will be held on Wednesday, February 11th from 7 to 9 p.m. Students will receive a wristband to serve as entry for movie night and ice skating in the gym at Lakes. There will be free ice skates and concessions will be served. Check your email to vote for what movie you'd like to see. Open mic night will be held on Thursday, February 12th in the Commons at 7 p.m. Entrance is $5, and there will be free Starbucks coffee and Taz OT available. Come support your fellow Eagles and enjoy some good music. If you're interested in performing at Open Mic Night, contact Miss Cody for more information. Hey, Eagles. This is Tom Lee with Sports. Great job to the dance team on coming in fourth place at State this weekend. We would also like to congratulate the cheer team on qualifying for State. They are competing this weekend. Good luck, girls. The boys' basketball team finished off a great month with two wins over Oswego East and Round Lake. They finished January with an impressive record of 6-1. and one. They also destroyed North Chicago Tuesday. Awesome job to girls' basketball team on Glenbrook North last weekend. Great job to Jared Smith on taking second place at conference over the weekend in his weight class. Let's go over the Royal Rush leaders with the Royal Rush update. Hey guys, what's up Eagles? Sorry Dalton couldn't make it, he took the stairs. Anyways, with or without Dalton, we have a big weekend starting tonight with boys and girls basketball both throwing down. Boys basketball is at Grant at 7 o'clock and the girls are at home against Antioch. Also a special shout out to our Lake dancers because they killed it this weekend up at State and got fourth place. Also, our cheerleaders are heading up to Bloomington and they're going for gold this weekend. Tomorrow, we got the boys IHSA Regional for wrestling at Vernon Hills. Also, the girls bowling IHSA Regional is at Warren. Sunday, we got Winter Guard performing three times at 10, 1, and 350. So go out there and support the Eagles. Monday, boys basketball is at Carmel. And also on Tuesday, we have girls basketball at Warren. We have our fan section vid coming up this week. Check out Eagles Eye News for that. See you next week, Eagles. NHS will be accepting denim items such as pants, jeans, jackets, and shirts throughout next week. Items will be donated to a homeless shelter in Racine, Wisconsin. Drop off any items in the drop box in the main office. If you're a senior worried about paying for college, the local scholarship application is now available. There are 21 different scholarships being offered. Go to the link on the student services page and submit your form by Thursday, February 19th. See Ms. Carney or Ms. Puka with any questions. The Eagles Wellness Challenge opens up on Wednesday, February 11th in the cafeteria. T-shirts will be sold for $7 and be sure to follow Eagles Be Well on Twitter and Instagram. Last Sunday marked the start of Black History Month. Each week, the Global Studies classes focus on a specific question. The question this week was, why is it important to study the Civil Rights Movement? They've talked about various events, such as Plessy versus Ferguson and Brown versus the Board of Education. Check lakesudentmedia.com each week to see some of their answers. Congratulations to Jake Ballou and Ryan Mullen for signing with Winona State University and Miami University of Ohio. If there's anything you feel should be on Eagle Eye News, go to lakestudentmedia.com and click Announcement Request. Submit your idea for a chance to see your request aired on a future broadcast. That's it for this week. I'm Jess Ward. And I'm Colton Jewell. See you next week, Eagles. <laughs>